Today we'll be showing you how to set up an MLA paper format in Microsoft Word. To get started, let's change our font to Times New Roman. And then we want to go ahead and also change the size to 12. After we get done with that, we're heading over to the paragraph section. The up and down arrows right here, we want 2.0 for double spacing. And then we want to remove our space after paragraph. We want to double click at the top of our page and head over to page number, top of page, plain numbers, right hand side, and then put in your last name. Double click to exit and then start typing in your name followed by your professor, the class, and then you also want to include your date. Make sure you have it in day, month, year format and make sure that you spell out your month as well. Our next line we want to center and this is going to be our title line standard capitalization no underlining or bolding and then our next line is going to be left aligned we're going to paragraph we want uh, indentation and then first line by 0.5 inches begin writing your paper be sure to include in-text citations and credit your sources whether you're quoting paraphrasing or summarizing and if you happen to have any questions about format you can also check out Al Purdue's website for some really great guides or if your question is very specific or you just prefer to speak to a person uh, you can contact us here in the library whether it's via email phone or just in person we love when people stop by when we get to the end of our paper let's go to the last line and let's insert a page break and then we'll get started on our work cited go ahead and center align it uh, work cited is not bolded or underlined and then our next line is going to be left aligned everything going forward will be we want back to our indentation and we want hanging indent this time when you're doing your work cited a couple things to remember always check your citations uh, make sure they're correct and make sure that you have all your in-text citations included in your work cited I recommend as you go along just going ahead and making your work cited and not waiting until you get to the end of your paper. It's much easier to go about and do that than having to scramble and find where everything was. Uh, don't forget to put your citations in alphabetical order by the author's last name. As long as you follow this format and make sure your citations are correct, you should be good. If you have any questions, just check us out at the library.